Today's question is how do I add a blog sidebar to my Squarespace website? What we're going to do is actually look at a real life client and I'm going to show you how I utilize Squarespace themes, a blog sidebar plugin to be able to create this effect. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I purchased and installed a plugin from Squarespace Themes to create a new feature on my client's Squarespace website. So first and foremost, Tim wanted to migrate from the automationstore.com to a Squarespace website. So when we transitioned from the automation store to Squarespace, we created a website that we called TW Controls. Now on TW Controls, we wanted a better way to categorize his free content for his audience. So when you go to the lessons page, you're going to see a gallery view of thumbnails. These thumbnails actually come from YouTube because Tim utilizes his YouTube channel as a means to drive traffic to his website. He specializes in automation. That's what he talks about on YouTube. And so people can actually go to his website, TW Controls, and they can purchase PLC trainers, simulators, testers, control panels, and supplies. So it makes sense that he utilizes YouTube because he can establish himself as a subject matter expert and people can come to his site not only to continue to learn, but eventually either buy products or sign up for his new training called the PLC Lab. The PLC Lab is a place where people can go for up to five days in small classroom sizes of up to six people to learn more about automation. So when Tim decided to expand and add the PLC Lab, we went over to the PLC Lab, we took some photos, we added those to his new website as well, but we really spent a lot of time on his lead generation tool, which was his lessons. So if you go to Studio 5000, you're going to see a wide array of videos. He had over 200 lessons on the automation store. So it was essential when we moved over that content from his previous website that we created a means to automate as much as we possibly could because some things had to be done manually. He had to add the thumbnails, he had to add the videos, any text that went along with it, he had to put that in himself. So what we decided to do was to see, can we find a way to add a custom sidebar to his blog that is automated so he doesn't have to create that post after post after post. After searching online, we stumbled across a website called Squarespace Themes. Now, when you go to Squarespace Themes, the first thing you're going to see is a curated collection of third-party Squarespace templates. When you build a website on Squarespace, you can choose a template from their library or you can utilize a third-party template that was built on Squarespace. And so companies like GoLiveHQ, Ghost Plugins, and Big Cat Creative create their own custom Squarespace templates and sell them on their websites. What Squarespace Themes does is it takes in all of these custom templates from all over the internet and it gives you one place to go for you to search through these templates. You can search by category, by designer, or by price. But if you want to utilize their plugins, you need to click on the plugins page. I have to say, Omari, I wish we could meet in person because what he did is he provided so much value with the curated collection of templates that people would come to his website to utilize that free resource and perhaps in the process, stumble across his paid offerings. This is a very similar strategy to my bootstrap club. I offer a ton of value for free by joining the Bootstrap Club. But within the same portal, I give people an opportunity to buy from me. 
And because I have established a relationship with them, it's way more likely that someone's going to come back and upgrade their membership on my site. I have gone to Squarespace Themes to try to find a custom Squarespace template for a client. And I remember seeing the word plugins at the top. So when I needed a plugin, I went back to Squarespace Themes. Now, if you scroll down, the number one plugin that has the most reviews is the Sidebar plugin. And I believe this is the case because many of the Squarespace templates do not have this ability built in. So without the use of this plugin, you would have to manually add a sidebar to every single blog post you created. And if you ever needed to update that information, you would have to go page by page by page to update it. So what I love about this is number one, it's supported by both versions of Squarespace, 7.0 and 7.1. This plugin will work with all the Squarespace templates, including third-party templates, as long as it's built on Squarespace. When you purchase the Sidebar plugin, you get a zip folder with instructions and the plugin files. Somehow, they also created this amazing dashboard where you can go in and you can customize the plugin. But here's the thing, if you want this blog sidebar to appear on specific pages and not just posts, you're going to need to know the collection number of your page. The average person is not going to know the collection number and that's okay because I found an extension for that. If you utilize Google Chrome, you can search for Squarespace ID Finder. And when you do that and click on the top right hand corner, you can add this to your Chrome browser. So if I were to go back to Tim's website and I were to click on this icon in the top right that says find Squarespace IDs, it would reveal the collection number for this page. Then all I would need to do is copy the collection number by clicking on it, go back to the sidebar plugin, and paste it into the box. Then I would just copy the code and I would install it on my website. So Squarespace ID Finder is also a free way for you to find your collection numbers which will help you with other plugins on Squarespace. Because we put in the collection numbers for the category pages, the blog sidebar appears here. If we click on a blog post, the blog sidebar appears here. And if we ever want to take things away or add things, all we need to do is go to twcontrols.com slash sidebar updated on this page and it will automatically update across 200 plus blog posts and nine category pages. Now, if you want to try out Squarespace themes, I want you to go ahead and head over to lashondabrown.com slash tools. Because I utilize their plugin so often, I've put it at the top of the list with MemberSpace and Flowdesk. These three companies are so essential for how I operate my business online. So if you have not gotten your free subscription to Flowdesk, you can get one for 30 days. You can lock in for the beta rate of $19 a month just by using my code or clicking on this button. If you want to shop the Squarespace plugin library, an easy way to get there is to click here. And if you want to try MemberSpace so that you can develop a membership like mine, you can try that for free for 14 days by clicking on this button here. So naturally, because I like this plugin so much, I am so grateful that at the bottom of Omari's website, he has become an affiliate. Remember, this is so important. After watching this video, I'm sure if you need a blog sidebar, you are going to go check this website out. And so because I believe in this company and the product and I've tried it myself, I'm able to show you tangible examples of how it can be used. 
I became an affiliate. So I received 20% commission on the blog sidebar purchases or other plugins that you purchase if you click from the tools page. Now you're welcome to go directly to Squarespace themes, but if you click here, you will ensure that I get commission for your sale. That's the only difference. Feel free to do whatever you'd like. Then I also get 30% commission on bundles. Now the bundles are incredible. If you are a Squarespace designer or developer, and you want to utilize the plugins on Squarespace themes for multiple websites, and you don't want to have to pay over and over and over again to add a blog sidebar to their sites, you can purchase a business license. A business license is going to cost you $149. But if you go to plugins and you click on the bundle, if you scroll down and you purchase the bundle, you can buy every single plugin on this website with a business license for $299. For the price of two plugins, you can have access to everything along with a business license. And for me, that was an absolute game changer. If for nothing else, I know for a fact that I have more than one client that's going to need a blog sidebar. Tim needed one and I want to add one to my blog because when I go to lashondabrown.com slash blog, which I'm currently working on, I have a few posts in there to get started, but I think it would be amazing on the right hand side to be able to advertise some t-shirts that I'm selling or some events that I'm doing and to be able to update it in one spot and have it show up on multiple pages of my website is going to save me a lot of time. So because I knew that Tim needed it and because I knew that I needed it and the cost of the two of those plugins is the same as the bundle, it made sense to go ahead and buy the bundle. So if you are designing websites or you're looking at this category of plugins and you're like, oh my goodness, you know, I need a ton of these, just run the numbers. The pricing is super affordable. You can definitely pay for the plugins as you need it. You can do a video light box for $29. You can do light box anything for 49. But as you start to add this up, if you feel like you're getting closer and closer to $300, it may make more sense for you to just purchase the bundles. Feel free to do whatever you want, but I just wanna give you that insight. So again, I really like that Omari has an affiliate program. And so if you purchase anything from Squarespace Themes and you enjoy it, you really like it, you think you may actually tell a friend about it, make sure that before you tell people, you sign up for the affiliate program so that you get commission on that referral. It does not cost them any more money for them to use your link. Be transparent with them. Let them know that you will get a kickback if they use your link and encourage them to do the same thing. When you utilize affiliate programs or rewards programs, not only are you helping your business develop passive income, but you're helping the entrepreneur who started the site in the first place. Because Omari gave so much value with this templates page without asking a single dollar, when it was time for me to purchase a plugin, I chose him instead of someone else. Even if there is another blog sidebar out there, I am going to continue to utilize Squarespace themes because of how much he chose to give. Thanks so much for stopping by 30 Days of Apps. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on the notification so you know when I've uploaded the next video in this series. My name is LaShonda, and this is Bootstrap Biz Advice, where I teach you how to grow your biz without breaking the bank. If you need help with your website, click on the link in my description to check out my Squarespace Expert Designer Profile. You can also gain access to my resource library for free by clicking on the link in my description. Until next time, ta-ta for now.